Okay, this is a short video to give you a potential quick fix for stick drift if you develop it in the Turtle Beach Recon Controller. Turtle Beach has a baked in recalibration process that you can do very easily in a very short amount of time. I think that's a really cool feature for them to include. I've never seen another controller that includes a baked in recalibration process, so let's get right to it. The way this is gonna work is with the cord plugged into the controller but not plugged into the Xbox, you're going to hold up on the D-pad and X at the same time. I'm gonna to have to set it flat to do this because I don't have three hands. So you're gonna hold up and X at the same time as you plug the controller in. And then you let go. And what happens is that light starts blinking right in the middle. I believe on their website it still says all of the LEDs will light up. That is not what happens. It's just this one in the middle that starts blinking. That means you're now in recalibration mode. So once you're in recalibration mode, you're gonna to wanna to go all the way up, all the way down, all the way left, all the way right, and the same on the other joystick, and then pull both triggers and release both triggers all the way. And then what you'll do is you'll hold down and Y at the same time, and that light will go solid for a sec few seconds and then turn off, and that means you're done. And I believe the way this works is it reestablishes new limits for the four pieces that you m recalibrate. So this did resolve the stick drift issues I was starting to get in my left joystick. Um, if you know, if you've already worked on controllers at all, you know that they each joystick has two of these potentiometers or omni sensors, whatever you want to call them. And there are fixes on YouTube where you can flex these little green plates open and pull the little sensors out and replace them. I've had some success doing that on Microsoft controllers. And actually, I replaced a sensor on this stick and that did the same. But the recalibration can be a much easier fix for your stick drift. So, thanks for watching.